Hello Python programmers. So I'm back from my hibernation. Actually I wasn't hibernating. I was having my semester exam, then practicals and lot of things happened in this time period. So uh, but now I'm back and I'll try to maintain the same schedule or same routine which I was having previously like uploading projects daily. Uh, I'll try to maintain that and I also have one announcement for you so from the day I have created my channel people have been asking me to upload machine learning tutorials so just to let you know guys that you that your voices are never unheard and now in a few days maybe uh, two or three days I'll upload tutorials for machine learning from the very basics I mean I'll start from the very basics that what is machine learning what are the datas that is used in machine learning what is the scope I mean from the very root I'll start that what is machine learning and it will take up to like one or two months and like 50 to 60 video to create enough base for you so that you can say that okay I understand machine learning because you cannot say that I'm a master of machine learning because this is a very vast topic and no one can master in that okay so I'll just create the base for you and I also have one more news actually I am preparing for gate examination so I'm just thinking that to upload a fee few videos related to gate examination also like the subjects like digital logic and databases I'll try to upload a few videos so this was the two announcement for you and now let's get back to our video or our project which is how to create captcha using Python uh, we'll be creating two captchas first is the image capture which will look somewhat like this and the second is audio capture which I cannot show you because my screen recorder is not capable to record the uh, on-screen audios so let's get started Okay, so now our first task is to first install the required library. Uh, go to command prompt and write pip install captcha c a p t c h a. Press enter. Now for me, the requirement is already satisfied, but you may have to install this. So so let's get back to our editor let me close this and let's start writing our code first of all let me import the required library from capture dot image we'll first work on the image capture and then we'll work on the uh, audio one from capture dot image import image capture make sure that this I and this C is capital and then we'll create a variable image uh, which will store the class variable image capture now if you want to write the capture in a specific font then you can just download that TTF file I guess this is what the extension of the font file is and just provide the path of that ttf file over here as a parameter and your captcha will be created in the desired font so let's create another variable image dot uh, generate and let's write our uh, data or the character which we want to insert into our capture 
data is equal to image dot generate this is the image and generate is the command here and then we'll simply write image dot write and we'll write the same uh, characters over here and then write and then write the uh, name of the PNG file now let's save this and let's try to let's try to run this by pressing CTRL plus B and no error occurred let's go to our folder and there you can see one dot png let me open this there we go one two three four okay now now let's work on the audio capture let's go back to our editor and let me minimize this this is a bit distraction okay so the audio capture will work as the same so i'll minimize this work by just copy pasting so this will be audio audio capture and instead of image there will be audio once again once again make sure that this a and this c is capital okay uh, then again the image uh, sorry the class variable will be created here let's give this the name audio and the class here is audio capture then we'll once again copy this and paste it here uh, let the name of the data be same this should be uh, audio and this is audio dot write audio dot write and the format for our audio file will be wave okay so now let's save this and okay I, I haven't run the file <laughs> okay so let's run this file ctl plus b or this is the shortcut for running your python file in the sublime text let's go back to our folder and there you can see one dot wave okay so this was the short way now let's try with the alphabets here let's say this is a b c d this is also a b c d and let's make this for the image also a b c d Uh, let's delete these two files now let's save this and let's run this and we are having an error let me see that uh, where is the error here okay so audio dot generate abc keyword error a I think that uh, we cannot generate the audio for the alphabets uh, okay so this is the first time I'm working on this captcha package so if anybody of you guys know that how we can use the uh, alphabets as our audio captcha then comment below because I really have to no idea about this i know that how the captcha package works and it was working for numbers and it also works for the alphabets for the image captcha but i don't know why the audio captcha cannot be created for the alphabets okay so this is it for this video and do not worry the machine learning video series will be coming very soon and now onwards i'll try to make regular videos like at least three or four in a week okay so this is it and see you in my next video bye bye